But I know it won't right. fucking stop it this time, because if it was going to stop it, it would have stopped it right off the bat. But the, my little circle's half full. So. Our session probably just ran on too long, and I needed to start a new one. I mean, two hours. Two and a half hours, almost. Yeah, go ahead and start another mission. That's what we're one mission away from being able to confront John. And then after we kill John, which John's fight is very interesting. Uh, oh, the plane fight? Well, like the lead up, the cutscenes in the lead up to it are very interesting. Yeah, I had a John first. Ah. Uh, I did with Juicy say. and them, but, it's but like, you say most people do I did Faith first. first. Most people do Jacob first, then they do John, then they do Faith. Faith is normally the last one you're supposed to do. I think the game wants you to do the the guy I just killed last, though. Yeah, Considering, the game wants like, you to do the build up to the... Because I think it wants you to beat this guy, then the druggy chick, or vice versa, and then the military dude. Because the brainwashing has a big emphasis on... Uh, the end, so I feel like the build up to that would be best built by like doing that at the end. Well, I, th I think it, I think the game wants you to do it the way I did it. Which is what order? Uh, John, Faith, Jacob. Technically, the first place it shoots you into is John's location, so. Yeah. He's just like slowly sneaking up on this man with a shotgun. Bang. He's gonna drive. I don't like that idea. I don't know if I trust this crazy man. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna hope that this works. <laughs> we'll see. I think it will. Well, government ploy of a scare tactic to pull our attention away from what's really happening. This place is ground zero for government fuckery. Baby farms, chemtrails, weather manipulation, pesticides, genetically modified this, that, and the other. I did some uh, is he just comparing pesticides and GMOs to like government experimentations? Listen, I don't, I don't trust crazy people, and this man is fucking insane. Is this the dude that makes you look for like alien parts? I don't know. It's a story mission, though. He's fucking ran over, ran into your dog, though. Ah, he's fine. It were to now. Oh, he just got out of the car. I don't think I've done this side quest. Follow you to see or anyone else. Those animals, I can't bring myself to put them down. That's right, deputy. I'm talking euthanization. It's We're killing some animals. Make sure you get them all. Why? I don't know, but I want to fucking kill a cow with my bare hands. Let's do this. I think this dude fucks pigs. I just gotta collat. Oh, the bear's out. <laughs> the fucking bear. What the fuck? <laughs> Square fucker. Oh, it's gone. Square fucking pig. Do this. You're the last bat here. Fucking square up piece of shit. It won't die. It's on fire and it won't die. I see it and it is terrifying. You were one of a kind. I'm pretty sure he fucks pigs. Well, one of them was a bear. Yeah, but like two of the 
pigs he made comments about, especially the female daisy pig. Oh yeah, he fucks pigs. Any demons come back here, they'll be blown sky high. We should do it. Oh, he just put a proximity explosive at the edge. I like the way he runs. Probably got scratchy nuts after fucking pigs. I still can't believe I ran back like into something. the goat fucker. What? Oh, that man. I'm gonna punch one of these cows to death. No, watch, they're about to hit the mine. No, they already hit the mine. Fucking square up, bovine bitch. <laughs> bovine bitch, he says. Explosives. But at the end of the day, I suppose we won the battle. Still, my, my heart is so broken. Oh, we can loot it. Hey, damage me. <laughs> I don't know why <gasps> I'm still taking the cow corpse. Do what? There's still a bomb over here somewhere. Like, under these cows is the bomb. Okay, how close are we? Uh, oh, let me check. Not that. <laughs> oh, hey, there's a Petzer Jerome mission now. Alright, sweet. Uh... I missed the motherfucker. How I survived that. Ah, <laughs> uh, I find it fucking hilarious. I think he's got another mission for us. I mean, he does, but Jerome. <laughs> Fuck it. Why not? I'm pretty sure this is the alien one. Yeah, he also didn't raise us up much. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna hit him where it hurts. The poor animals that died here today paid the ultimate price for our liberty. They are heroes and patriots. We will honor their sacrifice. Half this guy's face is burned. Tells us that every great victory Did he burn himself with his own threat. fucking flamethrower? That's right. It's time to hit Pater. And where's that, you wonder? The old gold mine. That's where the government's getting the funding for this whole operation. I found my favorite vehicle. Here's the quick rundown. Hurt those scumbag goblins for what they did to those poor animals. Place thermite charges on every stack of gold you see and blow their government funding to pieces. I'm sorry, I'm fixing this tractor. Something about blowing up gold? Ah, oh, we gotta blow up a mine. Okay, I have a tractor. Take a ride on my big green tractor. The bear ran away. Good. Don't get in front of me! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I want you to know that didn't no damage. Hold still. Follow me. Fuck it. You know what? Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Fucking plane strafing you. I know. Fuck off! I'll live. You like how I just jumped onto the blades and like your yeah. windshield was splattered in blood? Yeah. 
I like seeing them run. Have you, have you ever run someone over with those things? Oh, I just did. It is fucking satisfying as shit. Alright, this mission yeah, should get us good, because we're actually attacking them instead of just killing animals. Use a tractor to, obl to obliterate five enemies. Hi. And you suck at driving. <laughs> Why you say that? Let's get in this. Fuck. I thought this was gonna be much different. I saw the things and I jumped out. I don't see this other one. It's up there. Rig the oh, they have with explosives. explosives. This looks oddly familiar. Go get that one over there, I'll get the one down here. Okay. Right over there, I assumed you meant across the bridge. Yep. Cool. Your dog's doing something. Oh, he found two enemies. Oh. I jumped out of the building thinking it was going to explode and fell and died. The dog, I think, is going to get me. Yep, the dog got me. I just followed a man who was trying to kill you. I, I, shot keep, him in the back. I keep misjudging heights in this game. Go kill those guys. Hurry before they disarm the bomb. There we go. Fuck you, bitches. Aw, oh, I threw dynamite on it. That man's still alive. Fuck off, bitch. Uh, everything is on fire. Yeah. I threw lit dynamite. Hey, they're right coming in. in. Yeah. I know where they're coming in from. I threw lit dynamite right as um, the guy jumped out of his truck, causing it to hit him exactly and blow up. Ah, uh, shit, I'm on fire. Oh my. I only have a short while to stop this cultist from fucking. Oh, okay. Yeah, like I, I got here, but there's more. All over the gas. I'm saving your dog. All right. Yeah, you do that. Oh, no, Cross you're trapped underneath the fucking thing. Jesus Christ! How do I get to you? Just gonna fucking nope, Boomer. Okay. Got him. I Yeah, I saw that. I got hit in the head, uh, hit in the head with a baseball bat, whipped around, shotgun him in the chest, and then he just decided I'm gonna also rocket launcher him. Hey man, you can't just double tap, you gotta triple tap. 
No, I think a double tap worked on him. I killed a man, he shouted for Joseph in his like last words. Like my pink brass knuckles. God, I love America. Oh, no, don't you mean your pink paperweights? For the cause. I got Up. him. Across the bridge. I'm gonna keep killing people out here then. Come save him. Come save your friend. Take that as a no. Uh, okay, we should move. We should move. Bitch, I'm already outside the blast area. The bombs are armed. Now tighten your oh. butt hole and start running. It's about to snow gold flakes. I think you're in the clear. Now tighten your butt hole and bear witness to the sights and sounds of true hunting. I just see that one man running in there. He's so fu- Oh. <laughs> that one man's like, Guys, they don't mind for the bombs undefeated. Let's hope that pissed him off enough that we can just fucking go kill him. Yep, yep. I have an idea. Just go, just go. I have no idea where I'm going. Back, back that way. I can't mark a mission yet because it doesn't pop up till this guy's done talking. If you just mark, watch falls out. You pit cool too. There you go. All right, there he goes. Oh look, cows! Bye cows. Yep, I didn't even slow down, did you see that? Yeah. Oh shit, uh, and I fell off. That's fine. I don't know if you heard me, but I said this isn't the right way. Oh, I heard you. Nah, it's not the right way. Look at all these fish in this water. Josiah, do you think it'd be funny to just go to like a super white Catholic church and just scream Jesus isn't white to get a response? I prefer to keep all of my limbs attached, but... <laughs> Could you imagine their reaction? Oh, they'd be fucking pissed. I mean, technically it's a true statement, isn't it? I mean, no, nothing you said is wrong. Something's dead over there. What do you 
say something so correct and so brave. <laughs> one time, well, I remember one time at church, uh, my priest was uh, talking about the Holy Trinity, saying that they were all the same person. And as a kid, I couldn't get the concept. I still don't get the con concept. Con but, uh, so my my thing that I told him and that made him like take a double take was just, I'm like, so you're telling me that God knocked up a lady with himself. And my preacher just kind of sits there, doesn't say a word for like five minutes, and then goes, yes. You, you can tell religion is bullshit with that fucking statement. It took him five minutes. And then I asked him, I'm like, I'm like, do dogs and animals go to heaven? And he said, no. And I said, why not? And he's like, dogs and them don't know good or bad. And I'm like, I think some dogs are better than people. And he just sat there and didn't say a damn thing. Aw, oh, they're preparing for our wedding. And there's I love a dead the guy out the front. I mean, yeah, there's crows fucking say, yeah. nailed to the fucking door. You think that dead guy's a fucking... I, I mean, I didn't even notice the crows. Great start. Yep. I mean, at least he could buy his dinner first. I can tell... Well, that's, that's the hillbilly date right there. You can go ahead and skip this. Uh, if for the audience... Uh, it's actually not yeah, letting me skip it. Not oh, really. Rat. Sin. Must be exposed. I like how he's just straight using a fucking tattoo dill, but it's like enhanced, so it just cuts. Sin. We hide ourselves. It's supposed to say wrath, not rat. I like how he just rips the skin off the pilot, but yeah, no, it's not letting me skip this, so we're stuck. I mean, it probably will there in a little bit. Perfect. Yeah, poor, poor fucking pilot. That poor man. If Muhammad won't come to the mountain, then bring the mountain to Muhammad. Let's begin! I hate this guy so much. He's a snazzy dresser, though. Here to bear witness. You son of a bitch! Oh. <laughs> Let's try that again. Glaco, he keeps a gun in his Bible. That's my kind of yeah. priest. We are gathered here to bear witness. He doesn't fuck the kids; he just shoots them. <laughs> <laughs> to those. Willing to atone for their sins. Will you, Nick Rye, place your hand upon the word of Joseph? Will you, Nick Rye? Oh, fuck that. I ain't never given in to that psychopath. There it is. Greed. Always thinking of yourself. <laughs> you play as Nick in the Space DLC. That's cool. It's something about his wife. Nick. And his daughter. Yes. He just threatened so to kill his wife and daughter. Please sterilize it first, my god. I like how this whole time he's got the fucking gun in the Bible. And, like, he waits to give it to you.
God, that would be so painful. Oh, I'd imagine. I guess it's, he's already done it to the black guy. Will you, deputy, place your hand upon the word of Joseph? Renounce your sins and admit your transgressions. Renounce your sins and admit your transgressions. Say yes. It's just one word. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> I like how we just fucking took out his ear. That's, I mean, pretty shitty shot there, man. Come on. That shit happened to me one time. That's why my right ear's fucked. I want you to know I'm just using shells. Okay, cool. Let's use my bat. Oh, I died. Wait, what? No, I don't. I took your fucking gun. That wasn't my gun, but okay. Uh oh. Um, shit. On, we haven't seen enough. I had a glitch with this mission where it never showed up, and then another glitch where when you got to the she would just wouldn't drop. Oh wait, that's friendly. I mean, it's not anymore. They would have died anyway. Call that number in real life. I didn't catch catch it, but. Are you assisting me? I'll throw my fucking baseball bat at the plane, that'll work. Is that all you have right now? No, I got like AK. Guy's turning away. There we go. Alright, sweet. Now here's the most annoying airplane battle in the game. I'm gonna fuse a bitch. I'll get this one, you get the other one. Ah, oh, fuck. What's more annoying is the distance that it puts on us. We can't be that far away from each other. We'll be fine. Boomer is temporarily unavailable. I swapped him for uh, Nick Rye. That's a fair point. Fair plan.
God damn it, Hunter. Did you bump me? That was you fucking running into me. I like how he called this the most annoying fucking mission, and I just hit him with missiles, taking him, in, taking his ass out. When you had to do this the first time, you were stuck together in one fucking plane. Now he's dead. He's dead, and we've killed him repeatedly, and now he's just falling. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Oh shit! <laughs> Would you like to talk? <laughs> Our Lord Savior, Jesus Christ. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lay in and wait for his ass to fucking come down here to me. He fucking see Nick. He's just strafing the shit out of that bear. Nick's dude. gunning him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I ran into him. I don't know where he's gonna land, but I'm kind of already just down here on the fucking ground waiting for him. Oh, come on, I hit him with the plane. Yeah, I'm just waiting here. He's gonna land. I'm gonna put a round right in his fucking skull. Yeah, I Bye, know. John. Bye, John. I hit him. <laughs> I shot him before you did. Damn it. <laughs> fucking waiting. Just had my fucking gun pressed to his temple. I wish it let you kill him while he was on the parachute. Because, like, I ran into him two times and fucking gunned him down and he took no damage. He landed, just got a single round to the fucking center of his skull, and then you fucking shot a rocket at his corpse. It's like, hi, John. <laughs> oh. He's got many more bullets than he actually should. I look at pretty way. Joseph is right. Did you ever stop to think about that? Everyone thinks he's crazy, but he's not. Look around you. This world is on the brink. You can feel it in your bones. Look at the headlines. <laughs> Look who's in charge. <coughs> you want this key? Because you think you're saving people, but they are already safe. We had a plan. To be fair, those bunkers are nuclear fallout shelters. You don't believe? Uh, to be fair, when you get to the end of this game, you find out that you're kind of, like they're fucked up, but like, but like you kind of just fucked like extra people in the new world. You know what I mean? You just fuck extra people in the new world. Is that what you just said? Fucked them out of it, but yeah. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't it want really, them in like, charge, like makes you but think. they were at least right. Yeah, pretty much. Taking his body with me. I don't know what to say. John C. terrorized this valley for so long. Never thought I'd see the end of him. I want to walk up to their fucking bunker like, Hi, everybody. I think you've lost something. And then fucking just yeet the body at him. Okay, you want to take him? Where does it say the bunker is? I have no idea, but I hope it's far away. There's no telling what Eden Skate will do to them after all this. Oh, oh it's, it's just not. 200 meters away. I'm taking the body with me. Uh, did he just make a comment about how his wife was pregnant and using guns, and he's like, the doctor was wrong? I have no idea. I couldn't hear Nick over the guy shouting about, I need to go check out the shop. All I heard was something about, like, nine months, and then, uh, but then Dr. Buzzkill told her that she shouldn't be using fi firearms or something, and I'm just sitting here thinking, what the fuck? Who's looking to get the index now? There's no one here, by the way. 
This happened to me the first time Aww. I played too. Oh, fucking all I guess spawned they just all spawned in. Yep. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. How about a hop away? I'm gonna use uh, this asshole's body as cover. It works pretty well, actually. That worked surprisingly well. I got it. You feel like they would stop when they saw me carrying this dickhead. They would what? Stop. No. They know he's dead. Probably. Oh, what the? Take cover. Got him. Yep, you and your fucking explosives. Just say you're welcome. Fuck you! <laughs> you wind up hurting me more than you help me sometimes. Only sometimes. Most, I would say. On I that occasion, Jake. did I you shot... even take damage? Yeah, actually. But, do you think you would have fucking lived if you had to go one on one with that fucking heavy? Was it a heavy? Yeah, it was a heavy, that's why I blew him up. There we go. I like how they shout, not much for fighting Arya, as I'm shooting them in the face with a shotgun. Literally, I don't take Darryl. damage because his corpse blocks all the bullets. I shot through his corpse to kill some people. I'm not kidding. Are we saving? Uh, what's her bitch ass name? No. Not her. And not him. Not him either. It's like too white, too black. Ah, just right. I mean, you, the second one could have been a man, but okay. I think she's Native American, if memory Probably. serves. Her and the one like kid in the bunker are Native American. They don't really tell you much, uh, but like you know they are also like their fucking hairstyles. Something, something started. Even though hers is kind of like the anime mom that dies. He started scrambling around. All the doors started closing, locking us inside. I, I, I thought I was gonna be down. If I remember correctly, this one's almost the hardest bunker to get out of for some reason. Yeah, it's just because of a fuck ton of heavies. Right. And the condition of the glitch is right here. The rooms are grouped together by sections. Because she didn't got she doesn't fucking open shit.
tied to another control room. I can't free the locks from here. Rook, find the other control room. Wait, 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 the control room's locked. No missile found. Abort launch sequence. Okay, keep an eye out. I just lowered a platform from the missile launch silo. I just meleeed a fuck ton of people. I don't know how to get to you because I got fucking stuck trying to pick up one of my guns. Uh, you gotta go into the missile silo and then just drop that down. Doesn't help me. Is it this way? Let's destroy the console. Shoot the hinge on your fucking rocket launcher. I have a pistol. Is, your, is that the only gun you have right now? No. Oh yeah, the, the re the, one of the reasons this place becomes so fucking hard is because everything catches on fucking fire. There we go. Yeah, but it's this fucking section right here, I hate this shit. Yep. You gotta wait for the helicopter to get here. And the enemies don't stop spawning. There's no safe space to like sit behind. Nope. When I did this, I had a lot more heavy spawning in. There we go. I don't think we climbed fast enough. I <laughs> think we were gonna get scraped off the side. Also, the helicopter disappeared. Did you see that? It's right there. No, on my end it is gone, and then reappeared later on in the game. Oh, so, do you want to fight or leave, Joseph? Ah, uh, fight him. Fuck it. I know what both endings are, might as well do the one that actually you should fucking get. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you had a chance to bitch out at the start of the game, why the fuck would, would you want to bitch out at the end of the game? 
Because you don't believe in the power oh, here's, of friendship. Here's the cutscene. Oh my god, here's the cutscene. Oh yeah, wait, not this one, the next one. The next one. You gave us something back we thought we'd never have again. Hope. Whatever happens next, we're with you. Hey. That was a hell of a job, bro. The way I see it, you're the one in charge now. And if you ever need Thanks. Anything, just let me know. This is the last region you freed and it was supposed to be the first. <laughs> because of that cutscene. Yeah, he's cussing where he's like screaming, crying. Yeah, his like he has snot come out of his fucking nose and shit. It's gross. Another seal has been opened. My family, my brothers, my sisters—they've been taken from me by a snake in the garden. Yeah. Ugh. Too real. I like the aesthetic for the new game because they introduce like the two main bads, and the two main bads are a pair of twins. They're kind of—I don't know. There's just something about it that's kind of neat because they're like fucking brutal as shit, and like the bad guys are like these crazy psychopaths on like motorcycles and they burn shit down. It's kind of neat, and it has like a—it's like a really nice color aesthetic to it. I need to talk quieter. I mean, yeah, you're gonna play in the cutscene. No, I mean, so I don't wake my grandma up. Oh. We will be waiting for you. Where I'll take you for your stream. Nah. Okay, so he's waiting for me at his church, and the church I'm is in the middle, yep. So, you go ahead and you do you, I need to find something. I'll just be teleporting behind you. What do you gotta find? Not a piece of paper that I remembered about. So I'm searching. Somewhere here. I think I probably already do have it somewhere. I there forgot, is. like, there's a side quest where you help deliver Nick Rai's daughter. Yeah. I'll do that after I beat the game. Because I'm pretty sure it lets you replay, like, the area, right, as if it was you head towards the final mission. Yeah, I think after you beat the game, it just teleports you back to right before you play, you beat it. Then seriously, all the fucking Jesus. That's I right. guess we could have. Oh, just it's fucking far. Yeah, I'm holding ass in a sports just, car to get there. Now we just have a long, awkward ride together. Yep. So you like jazz? You know you could fast travel yes. to to Holly to Hollyhock Saloon, right? 
pretty sure that's a fast travel point you can go to. Go to your map. And then right before the fucking final mission, there's a car spot. Uh, zoom in. At this point, down. at this point, it's it's redundant because the time it would take um, us to load in there and stuff, we'd have already reached it in the sports car. Okay. When you say that, but. Uh... You like my bobblehead? Well, now I do. Is this something we're supposed to blow up? Nope. Nope. There's a plane to our left. Like, in the river on the ground we could have taken. Eh, we'll get there. Did you also see the person hanging from the bridge? I wasn't looking. I was looking at my map. My skirt's acting up again. With that, with like a ganda underneath my frock. You. You drove into it. I killed him. One sec, I got this. One sec. One second. I'm not in the car with you. Oh. There you go. Fixed. You do realize the vehicle self heals itself. Fixed. You're welcome. Okay. Right there was a fucking hint <laughs> as to what's about to yeah, go Yeah, it was gonna get nuked, yeah. I heard it too. You get like three or four of them throughout the entirety of the game. What the f fuck that it hurt the shit out of me. That's a fucking moose. But no, like, if you listen to the radio, like, there's like three different occasions where like, it tells you about like, the shit overseas. And I'm pretty sure it's Russia and China, or it's Russia and, out of the and Pacific. Uh, Korea. It's probably China. Get ready for a really trippy ass fucking fight. Bitch, I'm always tripping. That's fair. Just gonna walk up all cool like. And then there's you stupidly sprinting. I feel like he would have had better luck if he just told people, like, hey, the shit overseas is getting insane, I'm gonna have bunkers set up, if anyone needs to fucking stay in them, just in case fucking nukes drop, let me know. Of my family. And I am prepared. 
prepared to do the same to yours. But God is watching us, and he will judge us on what we choose in this moment. I told you that we were living in a world on the brink where every slight, every injustice. I hate this guy's sunglasses. Choice reveals our sins. And where have those sins led us? Where have those sins led you? It won't let me skip it. Your friends have been taken and tortured. And it's your fault. Countless people have been killed, and it is your fault. The world is on fire, and it's your fault. I don't know how you could blame the whole Was world's it? shenanigans on me. Was it? Also, countless. There's a certain amount of people that live in this secluded Montana region. I feel like we're undermining everything he believes in. You know what? The only thing that he's wrong about is he thinks that all our actions broke the seven seals to end the world. So, like, every time we kill a family member, a seal breaks. Every time we do a specific action, a seal breaks. In the face of God, I'm making you that offer one last time. And then this is supposed to be, like, our choice right here determines if the last seal breaks. So, like, if you're crazy enough to believe that it's your fault in this, and you take the ending where you just kill your friends, there's an assumption that you might not have caused the world to get nuked, but you and me are both intelligent people and know that it would have gotten nuked regardless. You're fucking insane. Is he? We never should have been here in the first place. You know what to do, Rob. I like how we are the only police, and it's four fucking of us. God is watching. Also, where's the fucking FBI guy? Or the, uh, not the, oh. the marshal. He wasn't kneeling. Oh, the FBI. The only thing I'm saying. Yeah, he's he's uh, he's dead. Did I? I can't remember. Okay. If you if you bring him back to the jail with you, he uh, kills the old man whose son died, and uh, he shoots himself because he gets hypnotized. Every slide. And I didn't realize that when playing this, and I had already made the choice. And every choice reveals our so technically, I think you can have it to where he lives, but he stays with the cult if you have him live. Is the only way to allow him to live. To be fair, he's a fucking idiot. Yeah, he was a fucking moron. And like, whenever you go to get this guy to arrest him at the start of the game, he's the one that kind of escalates it. Not that it wouldn't have still happened the same, but he definitely didn't help. Nope. Alright, so this is going to be a really fucking... So we gotta kill our friends while he keeps spawning in. Uh, but we also gotta pick them up. Don't let their timers run out. Uh, they will just stay dead. Up, but I got dead. <laughs> you're good, you're good, you're good. She She's picking you me. up. Yep. Pick them up before he picks them up or he'll turn them evil again. I, yeah, I got him. I, I already know what's going on, too. There's all three of them. Got him. Grabbing Nick. Grabbing the black guy. Behind us. I'm grabbing the housewife.
Ah, é, mano. There's a lot. There's a teenager. Shit. I'm trying to revive her. Thanks. Perk is definitely the way down first. <laughs> fucking rock in the back is not gonna be a fucking good thing. That's the bow girl. Oh, we're missing one. Uh, I got him. You don't know what you're doing. Only I can save you. You have to believe me. Ironically, no matter how many times we shoot him or whatever the fuck we do, he doesn't die. Yeah, it's a, it's a trip. You're just be, you're just breaking out of a trip. He just walks to the edge of the lake, raises his hands, and then a nuke fucking drops. And then you put him in handcuffs and throw him in a fucking car. You should have just fucking left him. I'm on an ATV behind you. Yeah, I know. Well, I mean, it is at least semi cinematic. This isn't actually a long drive. That was another one. Another one. Yep. The birds fuck. Oh. Yeah, birds, birds just came falling out of the sky on fire. fire. I don't get to see all the cool shit you're seeing right now. That's what it looks like. Look at your stream. That's basically what I'm doing right now is just watching your stream. That's the third one. I don't get why they would nuke Montana three times. This entire game is just a trip. What if that's actually what is going on? Good job with the fucking the car there. Together forever, get the end. So, oh, you're supposed to crash it, by the way. Yeah, I know, but you just fucking rolled it. Like real bad. Oh, I know. If that fucking pessimistic guy didn't pop up going, we're not gonna make it, we would've been fine. Good boy, that it's fine, because I'm pretty sure he ends up through the windshield. There's the no, fucking no, no, sheriff he... through the windshield. He's no, dead, that's though. the sheriff. No, they're dead. They're all dead. Yeah. And then Joseph C. drags us out, he kills the guy in the bunker, and then he gets rapey and says that we're gonna start our family over. Well, I mean, we're both men, so it's not really gonna work, Joseph. <laughs> Don't, that will, probably won't stop him from trying. I guarantee you, whenever we play the next game, we're probably gonna find the bunker that the main character was trapped in, and we're just gonna find his corpse. Or, hear me out, actual bad guy of the new game, this protagonist. N no, because it's the fucking twins. And you know that, that that's exactly what I would do, is be like, look, it's these two other people. Well, secretly. There is, there is like, guy. a little bit of, like, hinting that the fucking, the... The main bad guy in this comes back in that, but he's got to be at least like 40 years older. Well, I mean, honestly, it's just it's more that the ideals get passed down. 
That would also make sense, because cause he could die of old age, and then you could be brainwashed into taking over. That would be cool. Because Joseph should be a good ten years over you, considering that you're a rook. That would mean that you're 21, probably. Or at least, at max, 25 to be a rook. Here, I'm going to look it up. Uh, not the age of the main character, but... I'll, t I'll tell you what I'm looking up here in a sec. I'm just saying, secret boss would be perfect. How far after the new... How far yeah. after it is? And it says... It said after the nuclear explosions. It's 17 years, so technically they'd both still be alive. Oh, wow. So they said that, like, characters would return alive and dead. Not like the dead ones will come back to life, but you probably find their bodies. Yeah. But nuclear fallout has not been gone after 17 years. You can craft your own weapons in the new one. And together we you can liberate or scavenge uh, outposts. There's highwaymen, and they attack the outposts, so you have to defend them. You can only take your outpost back three times. That's... Before what? Before you lose them forever. Oh. So, like, it, there's another option where it's just destroy outposts so no one gets it, but you get all the, the fucking ethanol. Because apparently what you're fighting over most is gas. Yeah, that makes sense. But it's got, like, a pinkish and bright vibe to it. And like it, it looks it looks more like Rage than Rage does, except for the new Rage Two trailer does look pretty dope. It it, it feels a lot like Rage Two and Far Cry, just like fucked, and that's the offspring. But the trailer for it show that the two main bad guys were these two fucking chicks in biker gear that just attacked civilizations. It'd be real fucking they, like, funny if these two people become, like, the heroes. Like, Rook and Joseph become the fucking heroes. So if I hit continue, does it make me continue from that point, or do I have to go to New Game Plus? Uh, I'll continue to find out. Makes you continue also, from... my loading, my loading yeah. screen is just the town after it was nuked. Yeah. Except for when you load into the game, then it switches back to normal good boy. Normal good boy town. Uh, ironically, though, not much has been told about this game, and it's only a few months away from release. When's it coming out? Uh, let me see. I looked it up earlier. It comes out February 15th, and it's only 40 bucks. Oh. Are we sure it's not an expansion for this game, then? It's not. It's a game, though. That's it's weird. a full game. They've said it. The reason it's 40 bucks is because it doesn't include an arcade mode. Oh. I'm okay with that. And, and they didn't feel it was proper of them to... Uh, Charge for it. Charge a full 60 for it. If yep, it had less features than previous games. Yep, okay, you sweet. Did uh, fuck. Well, I finally fucking beat the game. What achievements am I missing? I missed um, a lot. It's mostly solo. Shit, you have yeah. to. Cult property. But there's a fucking oh, arcade the... stuff that we can do later. Yeah. Um, spend 50 thou. In vehicle shops, 
All yep. four fishing rods. Destroy ten planes while in a plane. Oh, and then you oh, and do a clutch like... Nixon in each area. And that's all the DLC shit. They're all rare achievements. Um, the easy stuff. Except for that one's zero achievement. Zero percent of unlocked. Yeah, I'll, most of this is arcade. There's like a few that are for story, but they're like the dumb fucking ones. They're like, yeah, because I think a good, like, I'm, I have 31 out of 72, but I think like 30, or I think 25 at least are for the continued DLCs. Uh... One, two, three, oh. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, ten, eleven. There's eleven I have for the story still, and then five I have for the arcade. And the ones I have for the story are like dumb ones, like spending money or, uh, I guess I could do that. Some, but some of them are easy to get. But the cult property one, grab one of each collectible. Destroy ten planes while yeah. in a plane, and the clutch Nixon stunts in each region, and distracting enemies with rocks. And that creepy guy that we were helping out that we thought was fucking pigs, apparently, like, one of the achievements is to help him through all his mich missions, and the achievement's called Defy Skepticism. Or See, like that. I thought those fucking things were familiar. Yeah, no, I got that achievement. Alright. Yep, time to be done. Yeah, it's technically an hour later than I was actually going to stay up, but, you know, fuck it, I don't care. Still quite a bit of time for you to sleep. 